What we have here is a reconditioned saw from Northern Tool. That is a Husqvarna 440. It's the E series, but I think it's an older E series because it does have the toolless uh, caps for the bar and chain oil and the fuel tanks. But you can just see that the clutch cover is a uh, standard nut that you would use like a scrunch on. But uh, I just kind of wanted to show you what it came with. It comes with this chain, which uh, looks uh, pretty much brand new. And then it comes with a bar that to me looked, it looked pretty much brand new. I, th I, think, I think it was brand new. One of the first things I noticed when I pulled it out was just kind of some of the scuffs and scratches on it. It's, it's definitely been used a few times. Also, when I opened it up to put fuel in it to start it for the first time, uh, I noticed that there was a little bit of fuel left in it, just a tiny little bit that you couldn't get out and a little bit of bar oil left in it as well. But um, not only that, but it also came with the scrunch tool and it also came with a little bit of literature. Uh, but there was a good scuff somewhere that I noticed. I've, only, I've not actually even used this saw yet. This has only been started two times since I got it and it's just been because I'm a little kid and I'm like super excited about it but uh, basically it is a pretty nice saw and I paid $1.99 for it where these are regularly like at Lowe's the 440 is a $2.99 saw so I think it's a pretty fair price and I'm, I'm pretty happy about it but it definitely was used no doubt about that uh, but it works, starts right up if you use the Husky starting procedure, and uh, so far I like it, but that of course is with no actual wood cutting experience. So we'll get out shortly and actually go cut some firewood with it. But uh, I think overall, um, just off my first impressions, that uh, you definitely can't go wrong. Um, if anybody knows anything about the classifications uh, of the reconditioned saws, this is a Class B. And Northern Tool told me that they sell all Class B uh, reconditioned saws. Um, I'll take their word for it. But right after I paid $199 for it, it jumped up to $239. So even the $239 is not a bad price, but if you can get it for $199 and you can wait, I would wait for the $199 price. But uh, yeah, so that's just kind of my uh, first impressions and first uh, thoughts of the saw. If you want to see more videos like this one, uh, specifically project videos, uh, then please go ahead and give us a subscription and don't forget to rate and leave a comment. Thanks.